Welcome to Mastering Solutions. In this motion problem, we'll be drawing a particle model for the situation of the man riding his bike. All right, so we have a guy riding on his bike and we're using the particle model. So we don't technically need to draw the picture because we're using a dot to represent the person at the certain position. So we'll do the particle model on the bottom. I'm gonna draw the pictures just so you can visualize it easier what's going on. But what they say is he's riding his bike for five minutes down the road. We're going to assume that he's going at the same speed. So we'll be drawing five, two, three, four, and five. So each one of these dots represents a minute. So we'll call this one position zero. Here's one, two, three, and four. So here's one minute, two minutes, three minutes, four minutes, and five. All right, so right here at five minutes, they say he gets a flat tire. So now we have to get off the bike and we have to fix the flat. So we have the guy down here fixing his flat tire at five minutes. And they say that it takes him five minutes to fix the flat tire. And then after that, I guess he just gives up and he starts walking and just walks the rest of the way. So here, whenever he starts walking again, at this five minute spot, he's going to be staying there for five minutes. So now when he finally starts to move right here, when he walks again, this is actually gonna be five minutes later. So from five to here, it's gonna be at minute 11 when he starts walking. And now he's gonna be walking at the same speed. And so we'll have 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, and 20. So 12, 13, 14, 15. All right, and they say that, obviously like we talked about, he's just cruising down the road, walking instead of riding his bike. So the most difficult thing with this one is just getting the timing right on it because it can be confusing looking at all the dots trying to understand which one goes where. But like we can conceptualize from this, he's going at a consistent speed here and he's going at a consistent speed here, but right at the five minute mark here, he's stopped. And so since he's not moving anywhere, we stay right here at the same spot. So from five to 10, that's he's going to be going there for five minutes, but then from 10 minutes to 11, that's one minute, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10 more minutes. So this is how the particle model would look for the man riding his bike gets a flat and then walks the rest of the way.